All right, now that we have the four basic tags inside of a notepad document, what we need to do is we need to go see if it works. But before we go see if it works inside of a, of a browser, we need to put some information in our website because right now our information or our website has no information in it whatsoever. What we're going to use is we're going to use a really basic tag called the paragraph tag. And we open a bracket, a P, and close the bracket. Lowercase p, close the bracket. Any words, text, anything that you want to basic show up in your website, you use a P tag. Now there's things that we can do with it afterwards, which we'll get to, but basic, simple, use a P tag. I'm going to put hi. This is my very first website. Then I'm going to close my P tag using a forward slash. Open bracket, forward slash P, close bracket. Okay. Now I'm going to save this. Okay. And remember when I save it, okay, I'm going to use a dot HTML to save it. I got to use a dot HTML to save it. If not, it's not going to show up. Okay. I already have this, so it's going to ask me if I want to replace it. I'm going to click yes because I did want you to see that. Remember, you have to use a dot HTML. If you don't, it's going to come up with that dot txt file, and it, you're not going to be able to use it. It's going to be a bunch of garbage on your screen because it's not an HTML file. So remember that dot HTML. So now let's go look at it. And what we're going to do is we're going to open up Internet Explorer. We're going to go to a new tab in Internet Explorer. And remember, this is just a file, so it opens up just like any other file. Treat it as though you would any other file. We're going to go to File, Open. I'm going to browse to my, this is my laptop, so it's going to look a little different than yours is, but it works the same way. There's my four basic tags, and it has the Chrome symbol because I use Chrome as the default on my laptop, but as long as it has a browser emblem on it or a, uh, a browser picture on it, it's going to work fine. Click open, click OK, and there it is. So, hi, this is my very first website. Remember up here, remember my first website, remember this is what I said inside of the head tag when we put the title there's where the title shows up. Okay, it shows up right up here. Okay, Windows Internet Explorer. So this is what you put in. All right. So website looks good. It looks like it's uh, okay. It looks pretty boring though. So we need to do some things to give it a little bit of pizzazz, and that's where our style sheets are going to come in. One thing while we're here in Internet Explorer, I want you to open up to zag.com and now that it's on here you guys hopefully won't forget that you can always come back and browse to this and look but it's tizag.com and this is just one really easy and cool tutorial for doing HTML CSS and as you can see a whole bunch of things so for those of you out there that think this is really boring and you know how to do this don't worry because you can learn JavaScript PHP, Perl, Ajax, ASP, Visual Basic, Visual Basic Script, lots of cool things that if you know how to do this and you're good and you want something else to do, you can always go to another tutorial and practice and see how you can do something else. All right, so hopefully that works and you're good.